All right, people, what's happening? Welcome back to episode two of the Ronaldinho Jr. Player Career Mode on FIFA 22. This is the second episode of the series. If you missed the first episode last week, make sure you go and check that one out. There's a new episode every single Wednesday. We've decided to continue this series. There was some good support and demand in the first episode for a second episode. So we are back today with a second episode. If you did miss that first episode, you know, go back and watch it because we explain everything you need to know about what this series is about what our plans are you can see we are currently playing for Gremio in um, the Brazilian league we are in also the Sudamericana competition which I don't know much about still but I do know we have a league the Liga do Brazil just a normal league table like with the Premier League the Bundesliga but we have the Liga do Brazil but we also have this competition running throughout the season as well called the Sudamericana which I don't know what it is really but I know in our group we have Lanus who are an Argentinian club we have La Equidad who are a Colombian club and we have Aragua FC I don't know if I've pronounced that right they're a Venezuelan club so the Sudamericana is a competition in South America all the South American clubs all together in one competition hopefully we can go ahead and win this or progress far in this competition you know as Ronaldinho Jr before we do try and make that move later on in our career to Barcelona so far we are already 74 rated at just 16 or 17 years old sorry 74 rated we've seen some great growth so far in the preseason tournament the team looked very strong we looked good clicking with the team very well playing a right mid role even though our position is a central attacker midfield that we're playing on the right wing but this is the start of the actual games now that matter the actual season is starting we have La Equidad in the Sudamericana first game of the season. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell so you never miss an upload in this series. Like I say, new episodes every Wednesday, but turn on that notification bell after you subscribe. Hit like on the video. If we get 10 likes, I will continue this series. I need to see 10 likes on every video, boys. If you just want me to continue doing this series, I need to see the support there. So 10 likes and you'll get the next episode. But let's get into the first game of the episode against La Equidad in the the Sudamericana. Let's get straight into it. The pressure is on because he's starting for the very first time. All the action is live with us on EA TV. We have, of course, started before in the preseason tournament, but that was only preseason. Hopefully, we can make an impact start on our first official game for the club in the Sudamericana. Let's choose our match objective: three shots on target, match rating or complete 10 passes in the opponent's half. We're going to go with that. Enhance this objective. We need to complete 15 passes in the opponent's half. And it's a bit of a kit clash for me. I think the tops of the kits, you know, our top is very deceiving because it's quite dark colours, but it's quite light in game as well. Um, but hopefully, you know, we can get into this. I love the user interface, by the way, for the Sudamericana. It looks very nice indeed with the player names on the bottom and the scoreboard at the top. It looks very nice. Trying to get something working here. Ronaldo Cabraz, he's hit the post already. Ronaldo Cabraz, what an absolute baller this guy is in the attacking mid role for Gremio. Uh, this guy is so good. He just hits it first time on the finesse shot and hits the post. Wow, so unlucky not to go ahead there. We're going to have to drop back and defend here. We're playing against a 3 4 3 formation, so our fullbacks are going to be bombarded by two types of wingers a left mid and a left winger. So we are dropping back to help out the team there doing our defensive duties you know and hopefully we can help the team in the attacking half of the pitch as well as we get the ball into our strike there try and spark the counter-attack he's gave it back to us as we go down the wing we're gonna give it back into our striker it's a nice play so far it's a nice play just offside what a shot that is good save from the keeper looking threatening going forward like equidad you know with this 3-4-3 formation getting uh, bombarded down both wings the fullbacks can't really handle the pressure of two wingers coming at them. Should be an easy formation to break down and expose, though. Down the wings ourselves. Off to throw in now. Can we get something going going forward? We need the ball into Ronaldo Cabraz. That is the guy you want on the ball to try and start these uh, these attacks. You know, we've got the ball to him in now inside. That's a great ball to us. We're going to play through our striker. Oh, the striker can't get there. It's a bit of a bad pass. Bit sloppy from me. Big tackle. Counter-attack. It's on. Oh, come on, ref. You can't blow the whistle there. He's about to counter attack. Nil nil at half time. I really do like the interface that they've got. Of course, they've got the official branding for the Sudamericana and the Libertadores. So I really do like how it looks, you know. We need um, nine more passes in the opponent's half to complete our objective. Uh, three shots on target he wants as well as an objective. That's a bit of a bizarre one. 
but hopefully we can let a shot off, you know, and maybe score a goal in the second half. It was almost a perfect run, wasn't it? It's a big ball from our player there. We've got the ball back inside. Ronaldo Cabraes, he's jumped over it. He's going to make the run, though. Can he get the ball into us? Great passer of the ball. Is Cabraes sweaty it across goal? Oh, I was right there at the back post, bro. He's got to pass that to me at the back post. No way. Oh, boys, that should have been a goal there. He should have passed to me at the back post. Can't believe he's hit that and hit the bar as well. We've got the ball. What can we do with it? Ronaldo Cabraes. This guy again. Magic. He's bombing forward now, Cabraes. Swift play. Come this way, come this way. Cabraes, play me through. He's played it. Go on, bang that. Let's go, boys. Come on, 1 0. Get in. Ronaldo Cabraes on the assist. I told you, when that guy's got the ball at his feet, he makes magic happen. He picks us out at the back post. Bad defending from La Equidad there. And we slot it in at the far corner. Get in, boys. Come on. 1 0 up. Let's go. Mistake from the keeper there. He's given the ball away. Like would that have a chance to equalise? Get the ball out. Come on. We've won that. That's our ball. Come on. Let's try and beat this guy for pace down the line. We've got a bit of acceleration on us now. Can we try and find our striker inside? It's a good ball to our striker, Penref. It's a penalty, boys. Come on. I don't know who's going to be on it. Probably Ronaldo Cabraes. That guy's 83 rated overall. So he's probably got the best penalties in a team. It might be the striker on it, though. It's going to be Ronaldo Cabraes. Can he score the penalty? Go on. Of course he can. Never a doubt in my mind. This guy is absolutely fantastic. What a player to be playing alongside. Cool, calm, collected into the side net. And what a penalty that is. What a guy Ronaldo Cabraes is. What the hell is our keeper doing, bro? Oh my god, what's he doing running out of the box like that? Solid win there, boys. In our first game in the Sudamericana, it's 2 0. We obviously passed to the guy who won the penalty, which Ronaldo Cabraes did took away. So that's a, a pass to the assist, I guess. And then we also got on the score sheet as well. Solid, solid performance from the team, from us there in that game as well. Very nice to see. The next game of the season, we actually got man of the match there as well. 10 out of 10 rating. You do absolutely love to see that heat map we're covering the whole pitch, you know what I mean? We are a team player. I am really enjoying this dynamic of using just one player in the team and, you know, not having to worry about controlling the defence or the keeper or, you know, anything like that, just controlling one player. It is very fun this year. I'll give it to EAD. I've made player career mode very fun to play. Next up, boys, our first game in the Liga do Brasil against Chapecoense. Let's get into this one. Hopefully, we can beat these. A five-at-the-back formation for Chapecoense, so it's going to be hard to break these guys down. If you watch my Creator Club series on the YouTube channel, you'll know how difficult I find it to break down a 4-5-1 or five-at-the-back formation, I should say. Um, so, yeah, hopefully our team, Ronaldo Camparais, can pick out an expert pass and break down his defence for us. Because we are only controlling one man, we don't really need to break, worry about breaking down the defence, you know, it's just getting in behind it and then scoring. The man to watch. Three goals in three games, a nightmare for opposing defenders. This is EA TV. We are in great form at the moment. Hopefully we can continue that into the league run in the Liga do Brasil and hopefully we can go ahead and win the league with Gremio. I'd love that. I was calling him Gremio in the last episode, but I have touched up on my pronunciation a little bit of Portuguese and Brazilian names and I believe it is Gremio. So I will start saying that instead of Gremio. Um, so let's see. Avoid losing a match, win or draw. Uh, conversion rate, shot conversion rate, 65% or target. You know what? I'm going to go for the avoid a loss objective. Hopefully we can go ahead and get the W here. Would absolutely love to see uh, a win to start off the league campaign, you know. Let's try and get on the ball early. Try and get something going as we show off our little bits of skill there. Uh, as always, being Ronaldinho's son. Uh, but we've gave the ball away already. Cabraes, he gets the ball into us. Can we have an early start to the game? Cabraes, is he going to find us again? Cabraes showing off his skills there. Let's get a ball across to me. It's came to me. And it's going to be a goal already, boys. Three minutes in. That's what you absolutely love to see. That's what I do. That's what I've came here to do. I've came here to be an absolute beast. You know, levels above the team. Levels above the team rating. Uh, or the overall rating of our pro that we do have right now. 74 rated. Are you mad? I'm playing like a 90 rated veteran. You wouldn't think I'm a 74 rated 17 year old rookie uh, in this league right here. Definitely need to move to a harder league uh, in the future or as soon as possible, really. I do want to try and win, you know, the Sudamericana and Liga Double. Brazil with Gremio but I do think we need to move to a harder league because right now it does feel a bit too easy for me we've won it back though straight away let's go that's what we do 
That is what we do. Ronaldo Cabrais on the inside. Yes, mate. Yes, mate. Jose, come on. Ah, unlucky. Win that ball. Jadson. Nice. Back into Jadson. Can we get a an assist in this game? What a pass that is. What a save from the keeper there. You see that little Ronaldo chop heel pass there? And then what a save from the keeper. Wow. Well in Juliano. Over the top, yes. I'm down the left wing. I'm down the left wing. I've got major space. Get it inside. On the overlap. Inside. Inside, Cabraz. One more, Jadson. Hold it up for me. Oh, Jadson, that's such a bad pass, bro. Penrith. <laughs> now, that's such a bad pass again. We've been denied an opportunity to score from a bad pass from our teammate. Counter-attack, Cabraz. I'm going to call for an ambitious ball over the top. But this guy's so good. He's found it on the volley. What a goal that is. What a finish from us. Ronaldo Cabraz. This guy is an absolute hero. I wish when we do transfer away from Gremio, I wish we could take Cabraz with us. Because this guy is absolutely fantastic. I've called for an over-the-top through ball late. It was a bit ambitious running in behind. But this guy is so good. That's a pinpoint perfect pass as we head it down. Smack it on the volley on our weak foot. And it's flew in. What a goal that is come on boys 2-0 that's a great pass down to us can we start the counter-attack ourselves i'm looking for our teammates in the middle it's a bad pass from us though bit ambitious again we don't have the passing stats of ronaldo cabrais you know when i started this career mode boys i set myself to an attacking midfielder i wanted to be a playmaker you know i wanted to play in that attacking midfield role or just in the midfield of the park you know and pick up the ball deep and launch passes forward to the attackers and get them in behind and try and facilitate our teammates but we started this career mode and we've turned out to be a top striker absolute bags man in front of goal in the shooting department and we've not had many assists so far in this series but of course that is down to the team playing us in a forward role you know we are a right winger so maybe when we move to another team, because we are set as an attacking mid, if we are higher rated than the attacking mid in that team we move to, then we will play there. Uh, but as of right now, we are just a right winger who likes to score goals. You know, I'm going to link up with Cabrera's again, try and get a hat-trick. It's a great touch. I'm going to go near post. It's an absolute fire finish. It's a hat-trick hero moment. Ronaldo Cabrera's come and give me a hug right now, mate. Because that was absolutely fantastic again. Look at us two dancing around each other here. <laughs> like absolute idiots. But... This is a dream duo, look at that. The one-two pass and the movement, it's absolutely quality. This is so fun. Like, this is really fun. I actually really encourage us to start a player career mode. This is actually really fun. The AI is actually intelligent. They give you good passes, you know. It's, it's actually really fun. Really low on stamina. Really need to work on getting our stamina up. That's definitely something I want to look and invest in skill points into. When we do get some, we'll definitely have some skill points after this game. After this performance, you know, we'll definitely get some good XP. Uh, and be able to upgrade our skill tree as our teammate finds us it's going to be 4-0 it's going to be 4-0 boys we are absolutely fantastic we are literally playing like a striker i wanted this career mode to be about creating goals and assisting our teammates but right now our teammates are the ones assisting us ronaldo cabraz wins it back gives it to our teammate finds a perfect pass into us as we're running in behind i guess this comes back to playing pro clubs as well i play up front on pro clubs so i have that attacking mentality to always make runs in behind and stuff like that so yeah just really good going forward we've scored four goals on our debut match in the liga do brazil ronaldo cabraz he's gave the ball into us we're gonna do a little bit of skill oh referee you can't blow the whistle there we were gonna go for the fifth goal of the game we scored all four get a clean sheet though as well and the w take home the match ball that is what you absolutely love to see yeah ronaldinho jr absolutely shining in the brazilian league five shots four on target four goals you love to see it we have leveled up now boys to level nine so we do have four skill points that we can go ahead and spend we are going to put these skill points into the passing tree. We are obviously a creative player. I want to create uh, goals for our teammates, but we don't have the best passing stats. As you can see, they're 81 short, 72 long, and 75 vision. We're going to boost our vision to 78, boost our short passing and vision also to 84 and 81. Uh, and then we have one skill point left, which we can get our short passing up to 75. That is a very nice upgrade set right there and that might take us up a rating uh, and it does it takes us up two ratings wow 276 overall we have also unlocked another perk slot so we do have active first touch on we can go ahead and apply another we have unlocked quite a few more perks i'm gonna go ahead and get this chance creation perk boys it's exclusive i think to career mode boost passing abilities for all teammates vision passing short and long crossing and curve 
I mean, our teammates are already boss at passing the ball. You've seen them assist us four times in the last game, but that's going to give an even further boost to the rest of our team. We are up to 76 overall with passing being the main attribute for a, a cams rating. You know, we've boosted our passing there, which has significantly boosted our overall rating. Uh, and we do have this second game against Lanús in the Sudamericana. Lanús being uh, Argentinian side, I do want to say. So we are away at Lanús, who are also top of our group. They did win their first game. We're playing a 4-4-2 formation. Let's get into this game. Our camera lens trained on one man. Four goals last time out. Can he light up the stage again? Don't go anywhere. This is EA TV. Let's get into this game, boys. Lanus, I believe, we're in the final of the Sudamericana this year or the last time the competition was on. So, definitely an experienced club looking to do well in this competition. Same as us, we are looking to try and win this competition if possible. I'm not too sure about how the whole setup works over here in Brazil with uh, the Sudamericana and the League uh, do Brasil. But, yeah, anyway, let's get into this. We're going to do goal involvements, get at least one goal and or assist. We're going to enhance the target to two. So, that's a difficult one to get. But scoring four goals last time out, hopefully we can do that again this time out, you know. We've won the ball back there for the team. Starting the counter-attack as well, we're away down the line. Going to get the ball into the middle. Ronaldo Cabrais, can he find that pass through to us? No, he can't. He's a bit slow on it. Oh, he referee. This is big. Come on. Oh, our strikers passing into us is always terrible as we give Ronaldo Cabrera a terrible pass. But Cabrera just found us. Let's go. Come on. Our shooting stat is only like 64 or something like that. But when I press that B button in front of goal, it absolutely fires into the back of the net. We have incredible shot power on our pro. Even though our shot power stat is not the best, Ronaldo Cabrera is very lucky to keep the ball there and just tow it through to us. And we open up the scoring already. I'm definitely going to have to adjust the difficulty maybe and or the sliders uh, to try and make this game a bit more difficult because right now it seems a bit too easy, bro, in this league. We've got the ball again down the line. I'm going to cut inside with a bit of skill. Get past one defender. Give it into Ronaldo Cabrais. We're looking to get the ball back again. It's great play from the lads. And we've rocketed it in top bins again. What is going on? This is way too easy for us. We are so, so good. Even the team, not just me. The team is so good. That's quality play between us, our striker, and also Ronaldo Cabrais. Look at this. Into Cabrais, into our striker. A little through the legs pass as well. Fantastic. What play that is. We're just a different class. Big tackle from us. Starting to counter-attack again, Cabrais and um, I forgot our striker's name, but they're always just sat there. Jadson Vidigal is our striker's name. They're always just sat there ready for a counter-attack. That was ambitious, but it almost flew in. I'm actually going to request a sub here, boys. We're running low on stamina, and I think the game is done. Let's go ahead and request a sub. We are going to come off now. For our teammate Paolo, I missed his second name there. Paolo Rodriguez was it? I don't even know, bro. But let's go. Two goals, no assists. It's a good, good result if we do go ahead and win this game 2-0. Score the two goals. You love to see that. The game does finish 2-0. Solid, solid win for us again. Another three points in the Sudamericana group. Moving on to the final game of the episode, boys. We do have Atletico Mineiro. Now, our father, Ronaldinho Sr., did used to play for Atletico Mineiro towards the end of his career. Of course, I do remember that card on Ultimate Team. You know, that was the card I used to see uh, Ronaldinho with on FIFA Ultimate Team um, being back in the 2012-14 days, you know. So hopefully we can beat our dad's old club as Ronaldinho Jr., our stamina is running quite low again. We might have to come off at half time in this game or towards the end. This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non stop hype all week long, and now for the action. Now, it looks like our game's actually glitched. Uh, and at the bottom of the screen, it's going to say Ronaldinho Jr. with a 10.0 rating and Gonzalez from Lanus. So, this is glitched from last game. That is not what we like to see. Will it unglitch if we pause it? and come off it no so nice one for that EA we won't be able to see our stamina for the game we know it's running low as it is but we won't be able to see our stamina so you're gonna to have to ignore the bottom of the screen for this game Atletico Mineiro looking very strong very uh, aggressive going forward you know so far this game they've been looking very threatening on the attack as we get the ball now ourselves at our feet whoa referee that's a red card he's came in from behind it's a booking came in from behind the referee's got a weird 
bald patch at the back of his head or something, bro. That's weird looking uh, glitch on the referee's head there. Weird. But, yeah, that's a bad, bad challenge there. As uh, Cabrales gives the ball away, you're not used to seeing that. Jansen Vidigal, he's played a great ball through over the top to us. And we are going to get it. But we have run out of stamina, bro. I need an option. We're going to give it inside. I'm absolutely knackered this game. Vidigal, can he get something going? No. Ah, oh, bro, it's so difficult not being able to see me stamina bar in the bottom left of the screen. That is such a bad glitch for me, eh? I'm sorry, bro, but the kits in this Brazilian league all look the same. I don't know how bad it is to use. I mean, they have light shorts, we have dark, but they've got dark socks. You know, I'm finding it very difficult to see who's our players and who's uh, their players in every game This in this uh, Brazilian league. Ronaldo Cabraes, he's going to play through the left winger. Can we give the winger an option in the box? Is he going to get it across? He's ran past the ball. What an absolute fool. Win that header. Big. I've got space. I'm going to play it through to Jadson Vidigal. Cabraes has robbed it. Cabraes win the header. Someone. Oh, come on. This is so difficult. The first time we've actually faced a challenge against Atletico Mineiro right now. It's a big interception from us, though. Spark on the counter. Cabraes hold it up. There's space to run into, but I don't have the stamina to run into it. I'm going to get that ball through. Cabrais, again, giving the ball away. So hard to break down this defence. They've been so solid at the back. And they're looking threatening going forward. Look at this counter-attack now. And now the second half is underway. Great skill from us, as always. Oh, referee, that's a ridiculous challenge. Oh, my God. He's got a booking for that. No way he's not booked him for that. We've absolutely done him with some skill there. Oh, no, it looks like he has put him in the book, but he didn't raise the card up. Uh, but we've done him with some great skill there, and he's just absolutely flew through us. Look at that. That's ridiculous. That is so dirty. That could have injured us there ruined our season. Vidigal, he's played it back into us. I'm going to bang one at the near post. Good save from the keeper. First time, we've got a shot off on goal, though. We've let it run to Cabrais. He's going to find us. I'm going to go near post. Good challenge. Ronaldo Cabrais having a stinker of a game, you know? It's not like him to be having a stinker like this. He's really not looking himself this game. Big tackle. Come on, this is the chance. This is the chance. And the emphasis is on creativity. Into Cabrais. Yes, come on. One more. I want to dink it over. That's poor for me. That is poor for me. Win that header, though. Get it back at my feet. I am the creative guy. I want that this assist. You know, I really want an assist in this episode. I'm going to run down the line, though. Oh, the defender's going to beat me to it. No stamina left whatsoever. I've used everything in the tank to try and create something this game. And it's just not worked out. What a pass that is. If we can win this ball over the defender's head, we're going to. What a touch that is. Go on. Get the ball back across into our striker to Cabrais. What a save from the keeper. That's a ridiculous save. What a save that is from the keeper. Ronaldo Cabrais, I said he's not looking himself this game. He should have scored that, bro. He's hit it straight down the middle of the goal. Should have put it to the left-hand side. It would have flew in. Oh, no, boys. Last minute of the game. Come on, put a foot in, please. Good save, Sheetho. Keeping us in the game yet again. Oh, no way, boys. No way we've conceded that in the 87th minute. The 87th minute of the game, what a ridiculous goal to concede. We've definitely had the more threatening chances going forward this game. And they just go and score an absolute belter. Was it our man as well? It was. It was our man. We weren't marking him. That is, that's on me. That's on me, bro. That's bad marking from me. But still, I didn't think he'd fucking volley it like that. Do you know what I mean? Oh, no way. No way. We've let our man go and cost the team there. And we've just cost the team by calling for the ball. Oh, that's unfortunate, boys. To lose that final game like that of the episode, to lose it is not good. And to not even get any goal contributions, that's not what we like to see. You know, we wanted to end the episode on a high, but unfortunately, could not do that. We go back to the Sudo Americana for our third group stage game of the tournament against Aragua FC. We will start off the next episode with that game. If you do want to see the next episode, make sure you hit like on this video. I need to see some support on this series. If you just want me to keep it going, boys, make sure you smash that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Hopefully hit 500 before the end of the year. So make sure you subscribe if you're not already. I appreciate you watching this far into the video. Like, comment, share and subscribe. I will catch us next time. Take it easy.